And this is actually the uh, fifth year that we've been working with Volcom to make the Pi Pro a, a deep blue event. Um, and it's been amazing because it, it, it keeps getting better and better like every single year, right? Um, you know, but the main gist of it is really we're trying to make this an ocean-friendly event. Um, and not only that, the things that actually happen during the event, like use of renewable energy, the use of biodiesel instead of petroleum in the generators that are actually powering 100 percent. You know, this very webcast. 100 percent of this this webcast is powered by. Yeah. No petroleum is being used to actually pure biodiesel. Power this right? Yeah, it's exactly. awesome. Yeah, um, it's actually coming from a local Hawaiian company called Pacific Biodiesel, which is one of the partners, right? And they actually collect grease from Turtle Bay, from um, L and L Hawaiian Barbecue, right? Right. To get grease, they also grow plants on the Big Island, and they take all that and they actually make biofuels from it. So it's local homegrown power. We're taking a look here at what it, what it looks like here on site. Exactly, yeah. So what's happening there is um, those are all the waste diversion bins, which actually get emptied and now separated. And that's actually being chipped up. So like all the food service ware that's actually served here, like cups and plates um, and utensils, we actually, or the uh, team at uh, Sustainable Coastline actually uh, chips it up and then it uh, goes into the compost piles that go back on um, Waihuana Farm. Right. So Waihuana Farm is literally right across the street from Pipeline, right? Um, and it's a local CSA, which is uh, Community Supported Agriculture Organic Farm. It was actually founded by um, Meliana Judd Cox um, and her husband. So um, deep, deep you know, kind of local roots here. And that gets made into soil, which is then used to grow more organic veggies, which actually feeds the North Shore. So we're kind of doing this in sort of a full loop circle, the way that the ancient Hawaiians actually did in the first place, right? So um, they're kind of the inventors, really, of uh, sustainable agriculture, you know, permaculture. Um, but they actually just called it the Ahapua system, right? So you had all the resources that you needed from the top of the mountain all the way down. Right. And you took care, you respected things that, um, every single level and you also knew that it took um, it, it basically took all parts to uh, make a whole and if you took care of it then it, then it actually took care of itself and provided you you know um, wealth and medicine food shelter and so much so that yeah um, and um, so much so that when uh, Captain Cook got here and they were you know talking about you know kind of what's happening basically they said hey a big swell came up in the entire village. Every man, woman, child bailed and went surfing, right? So it was this, I mean, <laughs> like, how rad would that actually be? We don't have that, right? So, right. like, the Hawaiians actually had uh, so had much it, abundance, right? They had right? it figured out. 